Hi, this is Regaline Sabat, also known as Gigi, and you're listening to Walk With Me Podcast. My guest today is Christy Lynn. Christy Lynn is an educator, speaker, and author, and she's the keynote speaker for our upcoming event, the Global Virtual Panel of Bullying Survivors event that will take place this Friday, February 18th at 5 p.m. Eastern. Welcome to the show, Christy. Gigi, thank you so much for having me. It's so great to be here to educate your audience on this wonderful topic that everyone needs to know about. So thank you for having me. You're welcome. And it's an honor to have you here today. Now, why don't you start off by telling us a little bit more about you and where are you from? Of course. So I am a mom and wife. I am a coach for moms, specifically helping them establish intimacy and connection with their partner after kids. I am a New Yorker. I live on the eastern end of Long Island, New York, and I am just so ecstatic to be here to be spreading the message about bullying, the consequences, and to give people hope. Excellent. Now, you have three questions that came in from an anonymous source. The first question is, what is bullying? So bullying is when another person or persons seek to uh, harm, intimidate, or, or coerce someone. And when we think about bullying, the bully is really attacking the vulnerable person. Okay, the one that can't stand up for themselves, doesn't have the strength to stand up for themselves. And they are, they become this magnet to the bully. Because when we think about bullies, if you've ever been bullied, the person bullying, there's usually some underlying reason that they are committing these acts. And it could be because insecurities, it could be because they are unhappy with themselves, or it could be because they were bullied at some point in their life. And it is a real uh, mental health issue as well. And we need to stop the spread of bullying and educate others about it. And that's why we're doing what we're doing. So bullying, to make it short, is when somebody is attacking another person, whether it be mentally, emotionally, or physically. That's right. And bullying is never okay. Now, the next question is true or false? Bullying can happen to anyone. That is true. Uh, Bullying does not discriminate. So ages, races, the like, anyone can be bullied. I personally, and I'll share my story more with you on Friday, was bullied all the way down from the age of five through adulthood, even Uh, in recent years. So bullying is non-discriminatory. It can happen to anyone. That's right. Any age group. Now, the next question is, how can bullying be prevented? Ah, yes. So education, education, education. Uh, It needs to happen in schools. It needs to happen with parents. It needs to happen with educators. Everyone needs to be involved in bullying prevention and given the tools on how to do this. I can recall in my life when I was in school and I actually told my parents, I told teachers, I told, you know, mentor figures about the bullying. And it was almost as if they didn't know what to do because they didn't have the tools and the resources they needed to educate not only um, children, adults, and those in role model capacities, but the bullies themselves on what exactly they're doing and the consequences that are uh, taking effect to these victims. That's right. We need to intervene early on and education is truly important. That way we can prevent bullying. And so it's all about positive intervention for positive prevention and positive solutions. Excellent. Now, the next question is true or false? Bullying can happen in any work industry. Yes, it can. And I am a victim of bullying in the workplace. And I will say that in recent years, bullying has become very well known in the work industry in in terms of prevention. And 
a zero tolerance policy, which is a very good thing. Human resource departments all over the world are taking it very seriously. And the number one thing that you can do if you're being bullied at work is to document every single thing that happens to you where you feel as if you are being coerced, abused somehow in whether it be manipulative or even a physical capacity. Um, these are things that you need to do to have that proper documentation in order for your employer to take action. Very powerful. And Christy Lynn, it's, it's such an honor to have you as a keynote speaker for our upcoming Global Virtual Panel of Bullying Survivors event. And also too, I'm grateful for our sponsors and our other speakers that are a part of this event. Such an honor. And I'm really looking forward to this event on Friday, February 18th at 5 p.m. Eastern. Ladies and gentlemen, make sure to reserve your virtual seat today via Eventbrite. Type in the search engine Global Virtual Panel, a bullying survivors event, and you will be able to locate it. And also you will be able to locate it on Facebook as well via the event page. And we look forward to seeing you on Friday. Have a blast. Yes, I, I, I am looking forward to it, sharing the stage with such wonderful speakers who are going to be educating everyone on how we can further prevent bullying in our society. So thank you, Gigi. You're welcome. And if you're listening to this today, remember bullying is never okay. Have a blessed day.